Speedway. It is now all quiet at the Indianapolis Motor Speedway after a busy day at the track comes to an end. But a lot of history was made at the world's most famous oval today, including the first Japanese driver to drink the milk in Victory Circle. Our Track Team 13 coverage begins tonight with Jason Spells and a look at Takuma Sato's first win in Indian. Good evening, Jay. The second century of the greatest spectacle in racing did not disappoint. The 101st running of the Indianapolis 500. In it, we saw 14 lead changes and some of the scariest crashes we've ever seen at the Speedway. Scott Dixon, your pole sitter for this one, but on lap 52, Dixon could not avoid contact with the 77 of Jay Howard, the sight of the nine machine flying through the air and exploding on the safer barrier brought an eerie silence to the crowd of more than 250,000 at the Speedway. Amazingly, he would walk away from this crash unharmed, a slight limp, but Scott Dixon completely healthy and able to walk away from this accident. Another monster crash would take place later in the race. On lap 184, five cars involved in this one. Joseph Newgarden, James Hinchcliffe, Oreo Solia, Will Power, James Davison, their day all done. That would set up an all-out sprint for the final 10 laps with Max Chilton, Elio Castroneves, and Takuma Sato risking it all for the win. In the end, Sato proved to have the car and the nerves to get it done. Andretti Autosport takes the checkered flag as Takuma's first Indy 500 victory. I just still cannot believe this. I mean, I, I'm, I'm so happy, so happy. But like lightning, raining, it's, it's Indianapolis. Uh, it is Indianapolis 500. We just won. Yes, it is. And uh, this is a fantastic moment. A lot of excitement from Sato. We have much more on our track team 13 coverage. Jenny coming up on the 13 Sports Show.